Hello everybody, Dr. Jeff Lynch from McKinneyDentist.com and this is Dental Implant Talk. Today I'm going to answer the question, can my body reject a dental implant? Rejection is an immune response. It's a body's way of getting rid of something that it detects as being foreign, usually related to foreign tissue transplanting in from another person. A dental implant is titanium. This is a large scale model of a dental implant in the crown. Titanium is very biocompatible. That means your body likes it. So much so that the bone cells will actually grow to and fuse to the dental implant. That's what gives implants such great stability. That's what allows them to not unscrew under the tremendous forces generated while you're chewing. So, a result of that is that dental implant treatment is about 98% successful. That is huge. That's greater success rate than root canals are. But still, that means 2% will fail. So why do they fail and what causes that? Well, the most common reason is infection. People who've got ongoing gum disease have a lot of bacteria in there and that bacteria can lead to early implant failure. Some people just are not uh, good healers. Uh, an uncontrolled diabetic or a smoker, they have a greater chance of having problems with, with any surgical procedure. So um, how, do we manage, how do we manage an implant failure? Well, most, most problems occur early on. And when that happens, what we do is we remove the implant. It comes out real easy. We repair the site, we let things heal, and we go back in about six months later, all done under warranty. So what can you do to improve your odds? Well, if you're a diabetic, you want to have your blood sugars under control. If you smoke, don't. That's simple as that. Um, keep your mouth clean and healthy. Like I said, infection is one of the big problems. Brushing, flossing, rinsing with the medications that we give you all lead towards reducing the bacteria in your mouth, increasing your odds of success. I hope that answers your question. Look forward to seeing you at McKinneyDentist.com.